Hey guys, special on the road edition this week of my weekly meal prep video. Actually back in Pittsburgh at my mom's place. Going to make one fairly quick meal that's easily able to be adjusted to make larger portion sizes for your weekly meal prep. Let's see what's going on this week. As you can see, a very simple ingredients list for the meal this week. Going to go some pork loin, boneless center cut chops there. Going to put some crushed pecans, salt, pepper, and honey on that. The sweet potato is actually going to be cooked in the microwave this week, so it's a little faster, and I don't know whose beer that is. <laughs> While the sweet potato gets cooking in there, I'm going to put some butter in the pan here for that to melt, and then we're going to throw in the pork chops after that. Feel free to use Kerrygold butter if you'd like. Butter's pretty much all melted over that medium heat. Shouldn't take too long because these pork loin cutlets are so thin we're gonna put those in there until they become browned on both sides only thing on those guys right now is a little salt and pepper to taste so the chops are about done to my liking sweet potato was cooked through perfectly gonna start to do the plating for this thing and then one last step for the sauce so took the sweet potato out of the shell, going to take a little bit of the butter from the pan and put that in over the sweet potatoes since I put some cinnamon on there just to make this a little bit more mashable. There's the initial plating. Now we're going to take all that good stuff that was left in the pan after cooking the pork loins, throw in some honey. And then, some of these crushed pecans. Going to mix all of this together into making our sauce. And just like that, you've got some center cut boneless pork chops with sweet potato covered in a honey and pecan glaze. Pretty darn delicious. Took about 10 minutes to cook total given that the sweet potato was cooked in the microwave. Now easy fixes you could do is not cook it in butter, use an oil of your choice or something a little bit less fattening. Um, the pecans obviously don't need to be used, neither does the honey, but that's kind of the point of the recipe. Haven't cooked anything with pork in this form yet. Smells delicious. I think it's going to be delicious. Still don't know whose beer that is. Questions, comments, feedback, give it a shot. Let me know. Hope you guys like it.